to you guys. See ya. Intro, day six of Robbie's travels in Erie, Pennsylvania. Welcome to day six of his sentence. It will be released in just a couple days if he's a nice boy. So we're headed to Michael's grandfather's house and he is an RC plane enthusiast. So we are going to let him try out the drone. Hopefully he doesn't crash it, but if he does, no problem. I've crashed it many times before. <laughs> Okay, what are the odds on him crashing it into the ground? Pretty high. What are the odds on him hitting one of us? Pretty high. Pretty high. <laughs> Wasn't in my shoulder at all. Oh yeah. There you go. That's one. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yeah. Right, one more. One more. One more. Right. Now it's facing us. So if you wanted it to come towards us, then you'd press it's forward. Right. What? But I don't know if you do. <laughs> <gasps> when I was a kid, we played all sorts of sports. Basketball, football, soccer. One we never played on an actual field was baseball. It was always just t-ball in the backyard. Baseball's all right. Too much waiting around for me. Actually, soccer and basketball, probably my favorites because even if you're waiting around, you still have something to do. You can run around. Which, if you know me, I mean, you know that's what I would prefer. Baseball does have these cool little dugouts. Is that what these are called? Bullpen? Can't remember. You guys know my cat, Willie. This is Willie, if he really let himself go. Words of wisdom, go. In the words of Guru Toby Keith, I ain't as good as I once was, but I'm good once as I ever was. Pepperoni balls. They were closed, I forgot to film it. This is Whippy Dip. It's an ice cream place that Michael went to when he was a kid. And he says, is, is this the best in Erie or best yes. you've ever had? Best in Erie. Hmm. Like I usually don't think of cemeteries as beautiful per se, but wow, this looks awesome. It's been at least 10 years since I've had one of these from Whippy Dip. I used to come here with my grandmother when I was like six, seven years old and she would buy these for me. Still tastes the same. <laughs> Delicious. Got a worm in it. Oh. So, this is a pepperoni ball. It looks like a donut and it's filled with pepperoni. Almost to the pepperoni now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have that bite. I'm pretty good. But I thought I'm miserable. How is it that every single ice cream stand has the exact same way that they write their stuff. They put like little dots. They probably, font. they probably go online and look up ice cream font. Yeah. We're at Topps Grocery Store. I've never heard of this place before. It's one of the main ones, the main chains in the area. Topps Dine Eagle. Kind of a strange graphic design. Like, look at these bananas over here. In America, this is real. We actually drink this much pop. That's just a couple families worth. Do you need any beans or rice? Never heard of this. What is this? What are you talking about? I ate this when I was a little baby kid. Quisp and Quake. These were spaceships, and Quake was like these kind of like a Captain Crunch. When I walked in here, I was like, dude, this place is like a time capsule or yeah, something. Yeah, they even have one in the no, wall. No, yeah, there was a time capsule on the wall. This place was a time capsule. I, mean, I haven't seen a box of this since I was 
since probably the 60s. No, wow. Expensive. Yeah, you can tell by the artwork. Yeah. It's definitely old That's school. like 60s, early 70s. All right. Netflix and grilling. Brachon. This looks like a Burger King commercial. Flame burrow for your protection. There's two things that are guaranteed when we come to visit Michael. First one is shepherd's pie. The other one is lasagna. Good night. Thank you for watching the vlog. Thank you for liking this video. See you tomorrow. Whoa! Don't have one of these earplugs? No. This is a typical basement in an area house. Where are the dead bodies? Probably in one of those scary padlocked rooms. We told you about those? No! Yeah, apparently like these rooms are padlocked and if you look like inside with your phone or something like that, there's just like a chair sitting in the center of the room. What? Yeah, <laughs> it's like a small little room with a chair in the center. And there's like another smaller Kobe hole that you can look into and there's like a horseshoe and it's nailed this way so like you can hang stuff from it. Yeah, all of like the main doors in the house upstairs have locks on the outside of the doors to lock people in. What? So I'm thinking this is like an old Puritan type house where it's like, you're a been a bad kid, go to your room, you're not coming out. <laughs>